Stop. H0-1 minute. And there is the announcement of the one minute mark. I was saying those VIPs are out at Tucon, about five kilometers from the launch, launch pad. They are going to see, hear, and you better believe they are going to feel that rocket when it goes off the pad 40 seconds from right now. Special greetings to those watching at Viasat locations around the world. Utilsat has employees all around the globe. We welcome them, Airbus Defense and Space, and all the other industry partners in Europe. Okay, here it is, what we've been waiting for, the countdown in French. À tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage des deux EAP et décollage Ariane 237. Well, no doubt about it, night has turned to day in the rumble in the Amazon jungle is that mighty Ariane 5 ECA. She's roaring out over Devil's Island. Take a La look at that picture correct. right trajectoire now. Est One minute uh, into flight coming up, and the Ariane 5 has already broken the sound barrier here in Karu. The massive Jupiter facility that I'm at, we're going to start feeling it and hearing it. And here it is right now. I can begin to feel it. The massive Jupiter facility would have been shaking as 1,300 tons of thrust breaks the Ariane 5 free from the bounds of Earth's gravity. 90% of that power is coming from the two boosters burning 240 tons of solid propellant in two minutes, better than two tons a second. When the boosters have done their job less than a minute from now, Ariane will be over 70 kilometers in the sky, racing away from us more than uh, 1.6 kilometers a second. And that's faster than a speeding bullet. Information coming to us now from Galat. The pilotage is calm. The trajectory is nominal. Right behind mm -hmm. us here in Jupiter. The next major event: the burnout and the jettison of those two solid rocket boosters. That will happen at two minutes and twenty seconds into the flight. So about ten more seconds. The propulsion is nominal. Give us the horsepower. And then they will extinguish and fall away. Separation des deux EAP. And there you hear it from the trajectoire nominale. The boosters have done their job. We don't need them anymore. On the pad, the Ariane 5 weighed 780 tons. By the way, look at the pictures from a previous flight of the boosters falling away. We're down now to 100 Weight Watchers, if you've ever seen it. Uh, in the rocket business, when you get lighter, you go faster. And Ariane is now really moving on out, uh, about 91 kilometers uh, into the sky. The trajectory is nominal. Uh, watch the speed number, 9.3 is our target number. Next up, the jettison of the fairing. It's covered the satellites on the ground and protected us from friction in the early part the of the flight. Est calme, la propulsion est nominal. And we don't need it uh, anymore. It is going to be uh, separating in uh, a couple of seconds. Aha. Separation coiffe. 